If my hair looks short, it's an illusion. I just have it tied up behind my head. <laughs> I didn't get a haircut. Hello my friends, it's Nina, welcome back. I am back with a clothing related video. As you know, sometimes on my channel, I like to try on clothing, put on different outfits. Also, don't worry if something moves over here, that's just my reflection. I am going to be doing a try on haul for Princess Polly, who I actually partnered with for this video. I have seen their clothing and it looks sophisticated, kind of trendy. They have a lot of basics, which is my style. But then they also do have a lot of pieces that are kind of out of my comfort zone. So I am excited to try these out. As you know, personally, I have a pretty simple, basic style. I like to wear things that I can wear over and over, mix and match. I especially love to play with accessories, so I did pick up some accessories as well. But I mostly got things that I don't have, some things that are out of my comfort zone, but should make some outfits spicy. So that's what I'm going to do today, and if you're interested in getting anything from this video, I do have a code with Princess Polly that you can use. Just use my code NINA for 20% off site-wide. Princess Polly ships from within the US and also offers free express shipping to the US on orders over 50 US dollars. And Princess Polly also offers afterpay to all US customers. I'll have my discount code and everything from this video link down below but without further ado let's try on some clothes so first i'll go over my measurements i'm pretty sure that everything i got was a size us 6 i already have tried everything on to see if it actually fits everything fits pretty perfectly so i was very happy about that i was actually kind of nervous about the size but everything fits nicely and we're good so i am 5 foot 7.7 i have to add the 0.7 because i was so close to 5 8 but i'm not 5 8 i'm like a tall 5 Seven. Basically, I'm 172 centimeters tall and my waist is around 27 inches and most of the clothes were a size 6 The website also recommends a size for you. I think also just reading the reviews helps a little bit But for the most part everything is a size 6 or a medium slash large But I think the first thing I will talk about is this top actually this top is from princess Polly It is their vintage shirt. I'll have the name of each piece on the screen, but it is this nice champagne color I love the size. This actually was a size 8. I do like to have some of my clothes have a looser fit especially blouses and dress shirts like this but i love the shirt i love the fabric it's like a good weight to it it's not super breezy or thin it's just right perfect for the summer fall i personally like to tuck it into some jeans but i enjoy this top very much i was eyeing it for quite a while i finally got it and then i guess i will talk about my pants that i'm wearing it is just these cropped pants they kind of flare out a little bit so it's not like a super straight leg these are a size six and they fit so nicely i like how they're nicely fitted here get on the bottom nice and loose it's definitely the shape that i wanted and is a little bit different from all my straight leg pants i was a little bit nervous about the size six but it was a perfect fit i haven't worn these outside yet don't worry all clean i also didn't realize it has this button detail instead of a zipper it just has buttons which i think is kind of fancy i love that these pants are high-waisted and i also enjoy the light denim wash and since these pants are cropped they have a nice youthful look to them and i think they would look good with sneakers or sandals but that is what i'm wearing from princess polly and actually speaking of sandals i did get a pair of sandals i don't have a whole lot of sandals recently i've been buying more sandals because i don't have much so i got myself a pair of sandals sandals these are heeled i also don't really have heeled stuff <laughs> these are just some tortoise shell strapped sandals they are a size 9 they are a perfect fit by the way everything is in u.s size because i am from the u.s but size 9 is a perfect fit for me i'm usually an 8.5 to 9 these are comfy and they also make outfits more fancy i was excited to get these i also like the brown color it's a nice very subtle pop of color i mostly have either black shoes or white shoes so this was a nice change and i guess while i'm on that topic i also did get a purse this is a a little handbag it's also brown i wanted to get some brown accessories this is a vegan material bag and it's just a cute little size i think this especially goes well with the outfit i'm wearing right now i'll just stand up a little bit here it is i've really been liking these small purses and i didn't have a brown bag so this was a nice addition i think this would go well with my shoes and then i guess i'll show you the other accessory that i have this is just a simple belt this is also a vegan material it has a gold buckle which would go well with gold jewelry and again just playing around with the accessories colors but i needed a belt so i got a belt from princess polly as well those were the accessories i'm going to go back to the clothing now so i'm going to start with all of my tops basically i got a lot of shirts because surprisingly i don't have a lot of simple shirts i have quite a few graphic tees pattern tees every other shirt basically except for a simple shirt so i got myself a couple cropped tees this is the poly tee and it is of course a size us 6 i just wanted a simple t-shirt that was cropped and so this was perfect i think it's a nice casual style 
style and I can just throw it on whenever. And then I also got the same shirt in black. I like to get a few colors of the same thing. So I have it in black as well for more outfit opportunities. These are literally just staples and I'm glad that I have them now. Moving on, I have another cropped t-shirt. And this top is very fitting. I prefer more of a loose fit, but I definitely wanted a fitted top, especially if I'm wearing overalls, for instance, and I don't want both my t-shirts and my overalls to be baggy. Although I do like that style, sometimes a fitted top just looks nice as well. I think this would look good with a pair of wide leg jeans, some overalls, the possibilities are endless. And then of course I have it in black, just a nice basic to have. And then I also picked up some tank tops. It may be fall, but it's still very hot. <laughs> I don't have all that many tank tops. So I did buy some tank tops. I actually have two simple white tank tops. One is more cropped than the other. I think tank tops are also just a nice basic to have. There's not much else I can say about the tank tops other than that I just desperately needed some. But I think they kind of remind me of the 90s. Not that I was in the 90s for that long. I was in the 90s for three years. I was still a toddler. But my mom was in the 90s and she wore tank tops a lot and this just reminds me of her. Her style was immaculate and I'm trying my best to be immaculate as well. <laughs> this is for you, mom. What I also love about simple tops is that you can literally just throw on a necklace, a purse, accessories, and you get a full outfit. I just really love accessories. Next, I have this gray t-shirt dress. It's more of like a very oversized shirt, but it does kind of pass as a t-shirt dress. You can wear this with a belt. You can wear some bike shorts or shorts underneath. You can tuck them into some jeans. I like this gray color and it has this sort of distressed detail. So I think it just gives an edgy touch. This definitely would look good with a pair of combat boots and I got this in a size US 8. I think it's a good size for me. Next I have another t-shirt dress. This one is much longer and it has longer sleeves. It has this cute orange graphic on it. It definitely just reminds me of summer. I also love the pop of color. I think this would also be nice to lounge in as well. It's so comfortable but I definitely love a nice t-shirt dress. Next I have this long sleeve top. It is cropped. It has these balloon sleeves. It has this elastic ruffle detail and this was definitely a summer look but I imagine that you can wear a long skirt or some jeans and a coat and it would still look good for the fall. I just wanted a nice fancy top like this. I like the loose fit of the sleeves and then the tight fitting form of the shirt here. I love how soft and comfortable it is and it is also a US 6. And I think this is the last top that I have. It is this blouse dress. It is a long blouse. It is nice and silky. This is a size US 6. You can definitely wear this as a dress on its own. This would have been perfect for one of my past videos. I did a K-pop idol transformation video and for one of the outfits, I needed the silky blouse dress kind of thing. I didn't have it, but now I do. This is literally perfect. It was an outfit of Jenny from Blackpink. I think you could wear a belt, some bike shorts under. Maybe you could also sleep in this. It's very soft, but I love the silkiness of the shirts. It's very lightweight, but it's not too thin as well. Well, but that is it for the tops. Now I'm going to move on to the bottoms. So I have another pair of jeans, a bunch of shorts, and a skirt. Let's get into it. I finally got myself a pair of white pants. These are sort of a straight leg fit. They're not skinny jeans. They are very comfortable. This is also a size US 6. These are perfect. I was just really happy that the size was right on the dot, but I didn't have a pair of white jeans, so I finally got it. And these are just the fit that I like as well. I don't like my jeans to be too tight. I like to have a little bit of room. And these jeans were just right for that. They also have a little distressed detail on the bottom. I think that's kind of cute. Just a good pair of jeans. They're high-waisted. And then next, I guess I'll go into some bike shorts. I don't have bike shorts either, but I've been seeing a lot of people with bike shorts and they look comfortable and they look practical as well. I don't have to be wearing a pair of shorts or jeans. I can just throw on a pair of bike shorts. They go above your thigh. So I think this would be nice to wear under a dress or an oversized t-shirt or really just any top, but they are comfortable. They're a nice fit. And I just really wanted a pair of bike shorts. And along with that, I also did get a pair of longer bike shorts. These kind of go somewhere on your thigh. They definitely do show, but that's cute. Most of all, they're just comfortable. I would definitely wear this under a graphic t-shirt, wear some sneakers. Oh, I'm so excited for this. And then I have another pair of shorts, but these are just some lounge shorts. These are so comfortable. You definitely can just lounge in these. I love this khaki color. This could go well with anything, but I like to have shorts like these where I can just sit and be comfortable and a little stylish at the same time. And then and finally, I have a skirt. This is a plaid tennis skirt. It is white and blue. It has this elastic, so it's comfortable and stretchy. There's no zipper, so you just pull it up. And this was a size L XL, actually. This is a nice fit as well. I don't think I have a pair of tennis skirts at all. Most of my skirts are kind of fitting, so it was nice to have a skirt that flares out. It's a nice, fun look. This would definitely be cute under a sweatshirt, which is also a trendy look these days. This will definitely be able to go with anything. And finally, we are left with 
with the dresses i bought two dresses they are both kind of out of my comfort zone but they definitely will make good pieces for outfits first i got this little black dress this is a bodycon dress and this is super fitting i got this in a medium slash large and this just fits me <laughs> this dress has a ribbed stretching material so it does stretch to your body i can imagine wearing this with combat boots a nice denim jacket over i think this would be fun to layer in outfits but it also does look good on its own this dress is kind of thick but I also think it's because of this ribbed material But I just like the thickness of this dress I feel like it's very sturdy It's very simple It's one of the most fitting dresses that I have I'm excited to make outfits with this And then finally I have one final little black dress It has a lace trimming And it fits very comfortably on me This would actually look so good with this shirt Not that I'm looking at it But I think this would also be fun to layer with as well And even though this dress is sort of loose fitting Not necessarily bodycon It does still have a sort of shape to it This is definitely just a versatile dress for any occasion But that is it for this haul we have reached the end of this try on haul that is everything i got from princess polly i just got a lot of basics that i didn't have that i can mix and match with clothes that i already have and i love the overall sophisticated simple yet also edgy kind of look to it i hope you enjoyed this haul or got some outfits inspiration ideas or you just had a good time again if you want anything from princess polly i have a discount code and all the links down below and thank you to princess polly for partnering with me on this video that is going to be it for me thank you for watching it I I will see you next time. Goodbye, my friends.